one, two. Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. I'm Chris HFM and this is another episode of Up The Goals with Torquay United. Now, obviously it's the big one today, Middlesbrough at home, FA Cup third round, since you were last with me, which was the Tranmere game, I think. Yeah, on the 30th, I mean, we haven't lost a game and we've been absolutely dominating. 3-1 against Dover, 3-2 against Ebbsfleet, 2-0 Stockport, 3-1 Ebbsfleet again in the FA Trophy, 3-0 against Wrexham, 2-0 against Flyde. Um, with the Christmas period where we got a little bit too, uh, too tired, I did change 9 of our first 11 and still managed to scrape a 2-2 draw with Eastleigh. We then played against Bromley in our last game. Picked up a couple of injuries in that game. Wasn't wasn't great seeing as now we today brings us to the Middlesbrough game. And I think the team I'm gonna go with today just doing another double check. But yeah, I think the team we're gonna go for today due to these injuries. I mean as you can see, one, two, three, Namane suspended, four for four injuries and a suspension. Not at the not at the best time, obviously, with this game. But nevertheless, team for today: Cavalan in goal, Cundy and Lewis are our trusted centre backs now. Uh, Rainers and right back, Bart and Anchorman, Davis and left back, Vaughan and High in the centre. Kalala is going to play on the right, Whitfield on the left, and Alexander up top. Now I know in the last game I said I didn't I didn't hold any sort of confidence whatsoever against Tranmere and they were in League One. Well, Middlesbrough in the Championship and I haven't got any any sort of hope whatsoever for this game. But who knows? We've we've used the magic of the FA Cup once. Can we use it again? We'll use the underdogs, let's go cause an upset again, and away we go. So, 10 minutes in, they've had one shot on goal. I mean, here we go. I'll tell them to get creative quickly. Let me just, we're just passing it down the wing. Friend into McNear, McNear brings it across, that's a great tackle, and away we go. Come on boys. Scott High now, coming forward, passes it out to Whitfield. Whitfield tries to beat his man, just flashes the ball past the post. And so far, so good. Nil nil at playing more, I'll take that. We'll get more money if we go to Middlesbrough's ground. I know it adds games, but it doesn't really matter when you're playing, in the, playing big teams in the Cups. Um, we're not doing badly. Carry on and we could win this. Optimistic, I know, but it could happen. Joe Lewis has picked up a yellow. Both my centre-backs are on yellows, which is a little bit worrying in this cup. Kalala's having an absolute mare. Offside line, I? No, Middlesbrough have gone 1-0 up. Flicked in at the back post by Fry. Oh, demand more. I didn't really want to, but... I mean, time's ticking away quite quickly. Vaughan's not having a great game. Kalala's had an absolute mare this game. We're going to put Jake Andrews out and swap them two around. George Alexander. Let's have a little look, shall we? Let's take the holding man out. We'll go two up top for the last. You might as well go for it. It's Middlesbrough, isn't it? Bourne hasn't played well, we're swapping with Barton. We'll take Bourne off. Put Jamie Reid up top. He can be a pressing forward on attack. Alexander can do advanced. Um, winger attack. Inverted winger attack. There's not really a lot else I can do with that. We'll go attacking. Shoot on sight, hit early crosses. Chuck the tempo right up, attack a little bit wider, distribute quickly. Let's 
we'll push them up not really anything else we can do come on then boys Andrews whips the free kick back post the keeper comes out and claims it I think I mean one nil against Middlesbrough isn't bad is it let's be honest three divisions above us even 2 nil is not too bad and we give a penalty away yep we are going to bow out of the cup in the third round of the FA Cup which I don't see as a massive issue we've had eight shots on goal four on target we've we've given as good as we could three nil is a bit harsh if this goes in good save Coverland. Yeah, so it looks like we're going to bow out of the FA Cup in the third round. But I think that's a good cup run. That's not too bad. I'll take that all day long. Can't fault any of you. Just one of those days. Wasn't too bad. We did alright. 2-0 to a championship club. I mean, where are our middles, bro? Well, I mean, they're 18th. I was going to say they normally fight out for the playoffs, but. I mean, they're only four points off relegation. But anyway, it is what it is. We're, uh, we're out. Torquay can be proud. I'll take that from Woodgate. Goalless Reed. Yeah, but he's on the bench all the time, so I'm not too bothered. So. I don't know. Maybe come back round here somewhere. Unless we get another FA Cup, FA Trophy tie, sorry. But um, yeah, that's going to wrap this episode up. As always, thank you very much for watching. Take care, and I'll see you soon.